One thing that really gets a seller's interest is when they hear that they have a cash offer. Now this could be an investor looking for a deal at a discount or it could be a serious buyer with a competitive offer that really wants to set themselves apart from the crowd. Hi, I'm Gordon Baker with Remax Alliance Group and today I want to talk to you about the merits and advantages contractually of a cash offer. Now if you're a seller you might be wondering what are the chances that I'm even going to receive a cash offer and if you're on the other side as a buyer what's the probability that you'll be, that you'll be competing with cash buyers. Now I want to show you a graph that has some really good information. It goes back many years and it shows that when we hit the bottom and there was a lot of uh, investor activity that the percentage of cash transactions were up around 40% as a high. Now we're back in the 20 to 25% range. So when you take away all the hype of a cash offer, what are the real advantages contractually of a cash purchase? A cash offer eliminates two potential contingencies. Number one is the unfulfilled loan contingency because in the contract it states that the contract can be canceled and the buyer will be entitled to a full return of the earnest money if after a diligent and good faith effort they are unable to obtain loan approval. So obviously with a cash transaction you don't have a loan and this contingency is removed. Number two, the appraisal contingency. An appraisal is not required on a cash transaction and therefore removes the need to renegotiate the price based on an appraisal that comes in less than the purchase price. However, it is possible that an appraisal valuation can be made a contingency to a cash offer. That is included in the additional clause addendum and the language is very similar as if a loan was being used. So let's look at the, the, um, the language. It states that this cash sale is contingent upon an appraisal of the premises for at least the sales price. Now the use of this addendum and this wording is very uncommon but it's something you need to know about. So there you have it. The two contingencies that are removed from a cash sale. Number one, the unfulfilled loan contingency and most likely the appraisal contingency. If you have any other real estate questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. Again, this is Gordon Baker with REMAX Alliance Group, 480-326-8571. Thank you. An appraisal is not required for a trash, can trash transaction to have a, the contractual benefits of a can 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 cash off. An appraisal is not required for a trash. It states that 